Um, everyone says, don't focus on content, do questions, do questions, do questions. What advice would you give someone who did content and has gone through their URL questions at full length are still low? What could it be? Content or strategy? That is, that's a good question. So I know exactly what you're talking about. A lot of people do say, do questions, questions, questions. It's not about the content. I think that's true, but it's also false at the same time. Uh, when you're doing content, if you're doing just if you're just doing practice questions and you don't know anything about like what you're doing, it's kind of like doing um, if you ever do like flashcards or like do flashcards that somebody else made for you, right? You're spending more time learning and trying to memorize what the flashcards are. You're trying to figure out what the definitions are. You're trying to figure out uh, what specific words are. Then it, it it doesn't actually result to learning. It just results to memorizing. Um, patterns and memorizing and you don't want to do that you want to be able to be in a situation where even if they stump you even if they ask you something differently because the MCAT will um, they'll ask you something differently in a different way each time and you want to be able to adapt to that because you have the content knowledge and you know what you're dealing if they disguise you know biochemistry in a certain way you can always adapt and, and adjust to it so I think the number one thing I took as a priority was uh, doing my content, understanding my content to a certain level. When I took my MCAT the first time, the reason I didn't do well was partially because I didn't do as many practice questions. But the main reason I think I wasn't, I was kind of sub 500 or 500 area was because I just didn't know my content well enough. I didn't know what certain uh, organic chemistry pathways were. If I saw an organic, I was, I, you would, you know, you probably feel the same way sometimes, you know, when you see an organic chemistry or a certain pathway or certain things that you're, you're weak in content wise, right? You see it and you get nervous immediately. Like your body just has like this subconscious nervousness to it. And when you, when you feel that it's because you don't know your content, but if you know your content, then it's like, all right, I know everything that has to do with this organic chemistry pathway. There's, they throwing it in a weird way, but I still recognize, all right, that's, that's like hydrolyzation or that's, you know, whatever it is. Um, so, with, with each section, it's important to have that content down. The only section you can't really have content in is uh, cars. But with every section, if you maximize your content, I think that that would just help um, kind of like catalyze and, and boost you up um, when it comes to your practice questions. If I didn't know my content when I was doing my practice questions, there's no point in practicing a skill. It's kind of like, you know, if you can't, there's no point in like practicing how to do like a fancy layup if you can't do a, a regular layup or it, there's no point in practicing doing something fancy and getting good skill base or you don't know have the basic knowledge um, of, of, you know, your content. So I, I'd say for sure content first, maximize that as the best you can and then, you know, go from there um, doing practice questions. Um, MCAT is a strategy strategy game it is partially a strategy game especially cars especially getting your timing down but if you don't have that foundation you're you're doing yourself a disservice in my opinion what's going on everyone thank you so much for clicking on this video and for watching if you're new and it's the first time you're watching one of my videos my name is Terrence and I'm currently a first year medical student in Philadelphia if you're new make sure you subscribe like the video and share with somebody that may need it my goal is always to grow the channel and help others that may need it so if you know somebody that may need this type of video be sure to share it if you're interested in hopping in on one of my live streams make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications so you know when I go live and get your questions answered live thank you again for watching be sure to subscribe and let's Let's get it.